Hello, casual citizens. We have considered playing the bongos. <laughs> the bongos. Matt. What? Matt. What's up, Dan? Matt. Yeah, buddy. Bongos. Bongos. No, we, we, no more bongos. No more. Because yes. now I'm actually concerned that all I'm going to get ads for are bongos. I mean, that would be awesome. What are you talking about concern? Uh, what do I need a pair of bongos for? What don't you need bongos for? Am I just going like, to go join a, a jazzy jazz group? Yes. Hi, Madison. Do I like your bongos? <laughs> oh, my name's Leonard, and I no, play the bongos. No, Sheldon plays the bongos. Sheldon plays the yeah, bongos. Yeah, it, it was Sheldon. Shoot. You screwed I did, up. I didn't watch a lot of that, okay? I'm a loser, I know. It's just okay. Oh. Uh, I really I really don't care for that show that much. It's okay. It has its moments. It's, yeah. That's it. Yep. It's moments. I don't know. You know what I like? I like Friends. I never Friends watched it good. because Maddie, Maddie likes it, and I watched it because Maddie yeah. likes it. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I I really liked it, and a lot of people are like, "It's just okay, you know. It's not that great." They're like, "Just the laugh track makes it funny." I was like, "True, good point." Same thing but that happened. Still entertaining. With freaking uh, what's yeah. it called? Big Bang Theory. Yeah. yeah, the Big Bang Theory is exactly the same. Same. Yep. Oh. You ever watched an episode without the laugh track? No, but I, yeah, I think I've watched like a clip of it, and it's like, oh, this is really awkward. <laughs> it is. But that's the thing; like, it's designed to be entertaining. Yeah. Not exactly. It's not exactly funny, but it's entertaining. Yeah, it's just it's okay. So you know what? I like it, and I'm gonna. I'm just gonna stick with that. People can sniff my big toe. It made me laugh. I mean. That's, you know, but I wasn't like, I gotta watch every episode. I was like, eh. Yeah. If it, Brittany really wants to watch it, you know, I'll watch it too. That's fine. Um, what's, with, what's with Avatar being super popular now? Uh, that just because, came out of the blue. Well, okay. First off, the show is amazing. And oh, yeah. I just, it's all, it's the freaking best thing ever. Second, um, it's now on Netflix. Ooh, okay. Uh, because Netflix, I think, bought the rights to it, and they're actually going to continue the original series. Um, the Legend of Korra was pretty good. It was no original. Um, but I think they're continuing with Aang and Zuko and Toph oh. and Katara you, and what's his How head? do you feel about that? I have mixed feelings. I think oh, I don't know how I feel about that. I think it was set up fine the way it was. Yeah. Uh, if the original creators of it have a story they want to tell, if they want to talk, if they want to, I know they did the comics. And I've always been interested in reading the comic books um, because they they do the search for Zuko's mother to see what right actually happened. I'd be interested in seeing that. Um, yeah. But you know. Like, clearly, Katara and Aang get married and have kids and all that. So, like, that love arc is pretty much done. Um, right. They never really an answered what, um... Oh, my God. Why can't I remember his name? It's not even a bit for the show. Like, what, uh, Katara's brother. Why can't I remember his name? Oh. Um, anyway, they never really explained what happened to him and, uh, Suka? Or whatever the girl's name is. If they stay yeah. together, they split or what? What not? Um, right. Yes, there's some. There's some like potential, but and they obviously have the the arc of they could talk about them more as adults and building the uh, Republic City building. But I just, I don't know. I'd rather them do another Avatar, one that came before or after Korra. Yeah, I would like before. Yeah. <clears throat> um, I, because I I like where it is. I like where it ended. Stay, I love those let characters. It, let it stay. Oh yeah. Like I like, I probably watch it, and I probably enjoy the hell out of it. But it kind of, I don't know. I feel like it had its moment in time, and we should just kind of leave it the hell alone. <laughs> hell, it's weird nowadays. It's like there are no original ideas. They either remake the movie or show. 
or they extend the movie or show. Yeah. That seems like all it is. Well, it's not always a bad thing. Yeah, exactly. Not always, but sometimes you need just to let it let it be, let it breathe. Hell, yeah. I like to see Iro like as a growing up. Like I think that would be a, an interesting arc. Cuz right. everyone loves Iro. Yeah. That would but be cool. At the same time, like it, well, it'd be that like the one the biggest it, so, where Aang was exploring the world and, and doing that, Katara was um, exploring her inside. Like, it was more about her figuring out who she was in the world and challenging her beliefs and things like that. Um, so, I don't know. I feel like there. Where else do you go? Yeah. Because you're basically covered in two plot points but I could see them I, trying to, to talk about inequality in an eff in, in a uh, effective way now right uh, especially but I I don't know huh I, it's probably gonna I, I'm hoping it's an entirely entirely different story arc and they don't try to go off or extend the original anymore yeah, you know what I mean. Oh, I guarantee you, it's gonna be. It's gonna yeah, just. Yeah. It's gonna be Aang. It. Okay, that's the wrong way. Rest in peace, Fox. How do you know? Uh, because it was up on the blocks, but now I don't know. Survey says. <laughs> Survey's <Nope>. wrong. <laughs> Survey says Matt dies. So, all right. Come here. Okay. All right. So, one, three, two, two. Well, it's not. It's not one to one. It's like slightly off. So, I need to go on this one. Oh, it's so confusing. Yeah. No, I, I see it. One, three, two. Two. Three. Two. What? Why is that off? Well, because when it. I'm looking at it this way, I would assume it would be the same, but it's not. It's reversed. So that that first one's this one when you turn around, but uh. it's, it's opposite. So for my brain, it's not. It doesn't quite line up. Oh, I see. But that's just me. Uh, were there any other like? See, you're, to kind of get back to the the Avatar thing. That's that's why it's popular. But is there like? Any show that you're like, they canceled, I'd like to see brought back or reimagined or something. Oh, I love regular show. Okay. I, I always like that. I mean, they did a lot with it, but I, I'd always like to see more of that. Okay. Um, maybe just like the original Scooby Doo. I just want more episodes of that, or the uh, the Batman cartoon. Oh yeah, that I was like it. See, so I don't good. know, because they're, they're doing the Harley Quinn thing, so they're kind of okay. trying with that. Harley Quinn's okay, but it's not, it's not, uh, I don't know, I just love the original Batman so much. Now, okay, when you say original Batman, do you mean the 90s animated series? Yes. Okay, because there's the 60s Batman. With no, Adam no, West, no, no. There, was like a, the, uh... there was a cartoon with him. No, not that one. It was weird. No, I like the 90s one. Okay. I think they are so actually good. redoing that. <laughs> I, I, you know what? I think I, I did hear something about that. I, that would I'm be pretty, awesome. Pretty sure I remember seeing somewhere that they are getting original writers back together and they're they're trying. It was so good. That's just... Oh, I love it. That was like my childhood right there. Well, that heck, heck dude. Scooby me too. But that was actually my childhood, because you weren't, you weren't born when it was coming out. Whatever, I owned all the VHS tapes, all right? I don't want to nice. hear about it. I watched them all on Cartoon Network. Ah. Uh, that's when it was, that's where it was when I was watching. That's understandable. You old fart, you. Uh, I, I am old and I tend to fart, it's true. Yep. Just ask my wife. What, what would you like to see? Oh, uh, 
Um, I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to hmm. think of something hey, that was it. done. Like, I, and, and of course, I could always go be like, "Oh, the real Ghostbusters again," but I, I feel like that time. That, that, I don't know that that's gonna hold up. They, yeah. If they did a, another Ghostbusters, but like kind of it took it based off the comics like there are some really and a lot of times they end up doing that but there are some really good ghostbusters comics um right they actually, they actually have gozer come back for a third time and, oh gosh and uh they like ki kidnap ray because it, it's this it, this prophecy from star book. wars no no not from star wars oh they're from God. ray i like i like both rays but they have this <laughs> prophecy book that shows like goes are supposed to come to destroy the world but because Ray stopped her like the book added a third page and had this other demon that was created specifically because that that apocalypse didn't happen and he's, he his goal was to ha make it happen like it was right. it's very weird huh but I really like it um so they're there I feel like if they could do a, a slightly more serious and I mean, slightly more serious than the real Ghostbusters. Which I love that cartoon, but my god, 90% of the episode is them running away from the ghosts, and if they just freaking blasted them in the first five minutes, instead of running around for 20 minutes, the episode would be over. That's like, like Scooby-Doo. Like, every time. If they just beat the crap out of the monster, they, they would, uh, they just solve the mystery right there. Right? Except for like the occasional episode where magic is real, like the the zombie island one. Yeah, well that's that's not in the original series. That's just that's like an extension it's a movie. Scooby Doo, man, it's so good though. Yeah, um, makes you think. Aw, oh, dang it! Actually, you know what? I'd like to see. I'd like to see a cartoon, um, of Star Wars, of like middle age Luke. Okay. Like not not a old old grumpy Luke, but like Jedi Master Luke just going around and being like, Don't F with me. Don't do it. Go right. stop being a dick. I will kill you. Stop it. <laughs> stop it. Alright, you're dead. <laughs> like, uh, like there's a lot of comics about him. Yeah, exactly. Should, that that would be cool to see. I, I would agree. like to see and I think that's what a lot of people were upset of about with The Last Jedi. And we, as far as I'm concerned, what happened there fit with his character, and I not I know not everyone agrees with that, and that's fine. But I I think seeing that would be pretty fun, uh, would be it a would fun be. show. Because it, it, it kind of goes from like, oh yeah, he, you know, he he won, yay, to all of a sudden he is how how much older, and then he just dies. Yeah. Like, well, it doesn't die per se. And even if I, they like show, and they take that opportunity, maybe they do want to like for the final finale or jump ahead, have it be like show why he's decided that. Are you tricky and being weird? Um, showing why he went to the uh, Antok or Island or whatever the hell it is. Yeah, and, and kind of giving people some closure, to, like understand right. why he went and hid more. Oh, there's uh, so much you could do with the Star Wars series, though. Oh yeah. I mean, look at the amount of books. Not even including the comics. Like just the books themselves. Oh yeah. It's it's ridiculous. I it's would awesome. I would so love to see Death Troopers. Oh uh, yeah. As a movie. Oh, uh, it's just I don't think that would happen, but yeah, that would It's a good book. It's it a is. really, really good book. Not and Han confused. Solo's in it. Yes, Han Solo and Chewbacca. Not to be confused with uh the Death Trooper. Stormtrooper class. Oh, well, no, that's not it's what I wanted. A, but it's, 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 like it's pretty much a zombie Star Wars book. It yeah, was it's, good. It's bizarre. I, I think it's it would be one of those rare cases where the movie would be slightly better than the book. Uh, but I don't know. It would I have really the opportunity. It. it would be a horror movie. For oh sure. Oh my gosh, yeah. It's it's not a like light Star Wars romp. It is it is no. a heavy book. <laughs> yeah, it's it's kind of disturbing too. Yeah, it's hella disturbing. But it, it was I loved it. Uh, some people were just like, yeah, it's okay. But I I thought it was awesome. I think that it it had a, a opportunity. It, it was freaky, and the fact that 
it it goes against what a lot of Star Wars books do where the hero survives all the time. That's right. not what happens a lot in this book. <laughs> <laughs> it, it really doesn't. It's um it, it the the ending is really interesting and I won't spoil it for you, but it just kind of gives you a little perspective on like why the empire was as bad as they were. Oh yeah. It, it's and like man, the emperor was a one messed up fella. <laughs> right. How long yeah, am I going to say that? It's cool. It's it's definitely worth reading. Because Star Wars is awesome. And that's that. That's that. I'm and on the next episode, I don't know, stuff? Stuff and things. Blocks of ice. Rocks. Is that a rock or a block of ice? it's just a rock. Because if it was ice, yeah. it could melt? But I don't know. Maybe it'll allow me to get up somewhere. Guess we'll find out, Matt. I guess so.